Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today in The Sims 4, we are hanging out with Anna here. She's working from home currently. We have two tasks we have to do. We have to write a letter and paint a political mural. So right now I'm currently at the library writing a letter because I feel like that's the easiest of the two tasks. So after we get done with this, we're gonna go back to the city and paint a political mural, I guess. We've never had to do that before, so I don't know exactly how that's gonna go, but she is done with that, so let's head back to the city. Okay, here is a little DIY mural thing. I'm gonna let her get started on that. She is getting a little bit hungry, but we do have a food vendor here if we need it, but hopefully she can just power through for a little while and paint it. I don't know if we actually have to finish the thing, honestly, because like I said, I've never done that before. Hopefully we don't have to finish it because I think they take quite a while. Oh, we have a little vendor over here selling their work. This is actually so pretty. I don't know if it fits the vibe of our apartment or I actually might would buy that, but that is so cute. We also have someone playing a little bit of music out here today. It's nice. It's a nice vibe, I feel like. It is kind of looking like they want us to complete this mural, which makes sense. It doesn't really make sense to paint a political mural and just leave it halfway done, but I don't know if we're going to have enough time, honestly. <laughs> I shouldn't have let her take in the shower this morning. It's put us behind and she's hungry. Oh, this doesn't even have any of the city food. This isn't a city food vendor where we can unlock recipes. This is like hot dogs and hamburgers, which is fine. I guess we can get a veggie burger. I know you're hungry, Anna. Finish the mural. Now we're at painting level three. Oh my goodness, are we gonna get to like painting level six trying to do this mural? I wonder if you have to get it done by three o'clock. Like usually that's when her workday ends. Do we have to have it done by then? Cause it is not looking good. It's actually kind of pretty though. Okay, moment of truth. It is officially three o'clock and nothing has changed over here. I think we're good. I, I could let her go eat. How close are we to being finished? Uh, I don't know. We still have a long way to go. I'm just gonna let her keep going for a minute. I hope the food vendor doesn't leave before I can get over there. Oh, we got some more paintings now. Oh, let's see if we want any of them, you guys. I love that one. That is so cute. It's 600 simoleons, though. I don't think we're going to be getting that. That's adorable. This one is also really nice. This one right here. I don't know why I like that, but I do. It's 500 simoleons. We need some art for our apartment, but I don't know if I want to go broke buying art. How did she come out with all these? She's been out here the whole day with us, but she's added a bunch more artwork. Oh, we're getting a phone call from Don. He wants to go out on a date, but I have to say no because I'm still working. Oh, I really love this painting. Should we spend 600 simoleons on it? I think I'm going to. Let's do it. Oh, we've made progress. Okay, we reached painting level four, so we didn't get to painting level six like I predicted, but I think we're so close to being done. And she's getting herself some food. She's actually done really well. She's been out here all day long. It's six o'clock in the evening. And look at her needs. She's done really well. She, I'm proud of her. And there is our little mural. Oh my gosh, we got there just in time. The food vendor just left. Look, that's him right there. He's leaving. Wow, that was a close one. But here's our little mural that we worked so hard on. It's actually kind of cute out here. I'm sure it'll be gone tomorrow. Our stayover house guests have returned home. Yes. If they've left, then we can actually just go on home. I don't even mind. Let's grab some snow globes and posters though before we go. And finally, we have our apartment back to ourselves. I want to see if they left their suitcases. We got another snow globe. We got a haunted mansion snow globe. And we got a freezer bunny poster. I don't, I don't know if I like that one that much. Yes, our apartment is back to our apartment. Look at the mess they've left. I mean, it could be worse, but they could have at least cleaned up before they left, honestly. Did they take their suitcases? They did. I should have sold them when I had the chance. Let's put the Murphy bed up and we can put our couch back out. Yes, it feels so good to have the apartment back. We could actually just sell the Murphy bed. Oh, we have a VIP bucket from our date with Dawn. That's so cute, you guys. I feel like maybe our Haunted Mansion snow globe would look better right there. Let's move that one. And then we have our brand new kind of expensive kitchen painting. I'm not going to put it too close to the stove because I don't want it to get burnt up. We got to keep cleaning up. We got a ton of food left out in here. We can go on and scrap Yul Reich's painting as well. She's been hogging the easel up. 
I feel like that was quite a successful day, even though it was kind of mostly taken up with work and we're not up for another promotion. We actually have to go to work two times this time before we get promoted. She's working on her little painting that we've had for ages in our inventory. Like I said, Yul Reich was hogging the easel. Oh wow, Penny Pizzazz is having a party over here, I guess. That's what that means. Let's knock politely and see if she'll stop. We're about to have to go to bed. Now we're waiting for the occupant, which is Penny. She's taking her time. Hold on. Anna's also feeling tense because she's unsettled by an odor. Something smells dank in this apartment and it's making Sims anxious. Oh my gosh, that's dark. Penny isn't coming out. Is she even okay? Here, here she comes. Look at her in what is that outfit, Penny? Should we just complain about loud noise? Let's do it. She's going for it though. She's telling her. She's telling her off. Oh, Penny's embarrassed, it looks like. She says, I'm sorry, you're right. That was a bit inconsiderate. We'll try to keep the noise down. Thanks for letting us know, good neighbor. Wow, I did not expect her to be that chill about that. Okay, I think it's time for her to go to sleep. We have a milestone that we fell in love with Gunther and Don Gooseman. I did kind of fall in love with Don Gooseman, but I don't know if I fell in love with Gunther, honestly. It says Anna's boss was happy with the work she did from home and she made 346 simoleons. Okay, that's pretty good. And I think we're just gonna work from home again. Hopefully we do not get another mural. Let's see, what is it gonna be? Today we have to start a debate for left or right politics, which it looks like we can do by talking to another sim. And we have to protest in the fashion district, which that was not hard. I don't mind protesting again. She's still very tense from this bad smell. I don't know what to do about it. Like, I feel like somebody should go check on the other tenants in this apartment if it's that bad. But we can go on and leave since it smells that bad. Let's go on and head to the fashion district. Is that where we live? We live in the fashion district. Okay, let's just go downstairs. What is that outfit? What are we wearing, Anna? I don't think I picked that out for you. Did I? I might have. Yeah, I bet it's her hot weather outfit. I bet I did do that. Okay, we got a phone call from Lily Fing. She says, hey, Anna, I've been thinking about getting to know Sorrel Thomas better as a friend. Do you think we should hang out? I don't really even know Lily, so I'm gonna say go for it. And let's protest. Let's just get right into it. I'm gonna look for posters while she's busy protesting. Nobody is listening to us. Nobody's even close. We might have to move over here. Maybe these two people will listen. No, they didn't. All right, you know what? I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move. She's very sad now. That's because nobody noticed us protest. It's okay, we're gonna find a better spot, Anna. That was a bad spot. We got a poster at least. That makes me happy. I don't know about Anna. Oh, you guys, she's so sad. Let's go over here and protest. Maybe this sim in particular might listen to us. The flea market's in town. Oh, she's leaving. We might actually go to the flea market, okay? Because I don't know if I ever have went to the flea market in the game. We did not find a snow globe, but we did find a keyboard, which is fun. We're still not getting any interest. We just have more people walking by us now. It's going to make her even more sad. Come on, stop. Stop and listen, please. We might have someone. Oh, I think we got her. No, she just walked right by us. All right, I'm taking a break from protesting. I'm gonna go start a debate with someone instead. Let's debate politics with Diego. Okay, we did it. We gotta go back to protesting. This is just ridiculous. Nobody is listening at all. They just walk right past us. Oh, hold on, hold on. We've gotten other people joined in at this point. I don't know if they're protesting me or if they're protesting with us. Is that Travis Scott? It is. Look at his crop top, you guys. Are they protesting against me? Are we competitively protesting now? I just realized that since I just went downstairs from the apartment, I didn't technically travel to the fashion district and that may be what's wrong. So I'm going to travel to the fashion district, which is literally where I'm at. So I'm gonna try it again now. Let's see if we can protest outside of this karaoke bar and get this done. I wanna go to the flea market. Whoa, here they all are. There's more protesters. Who all do we have out here? We got Bob Pancakes out here. Oh, he's on our side. We got the same t-shirt. We got Umber Grove. He might not be on our side because he's in his regular clothes. Well, they've abandoned me now. They've left me. They've all changed back into their clothes. Is Umber Grove gonna listen? Please, Umber, I want to leave. Hold on, they're changing again. They're, they're protesting again, but I'm not getting credit for this. Working from home is not fun anymore. This is awful. Oh my gosh, finally. Apparently, Unlike last time, it wasn't about someone listening to me. I actually had to finish the interaction totally. So 
So I ended up messing myself up by starting over. Whatever, let's go to the flea market. So at the flea market, we can shop for trash or treasures, find snow globes and posters, keep your eye out for boxes of junk laying around, set up shop and talk to any of the local vendors to trade our collectibles. We really don't have anything to trade right now, but let's go see what we can find. I don't know about all this, honestly. We got a nice little blue lamp. We could buy that, I guess. I don't know if that's a good deal. Should I haggle? It doesn't give me the option to haggle. I think I'm just gonna buy it. Oh, I do like this little blue lamp as well. I know we're kind of going overboard with the blue, but maybe if we buy this, we can actually unlock like a black swatch as well. I think that would look cute in the apartment. Okay, honestly, there's not that much to do at the flea market. Oh, we found Joaquin. Joaquin is out and about at the flea mall. And he left. He just left. He left us here with Joffrey. It says the festival will end in an hour. Finish up any activities before it closes. Be sure to come back the next time it's in town. I don't think so. Honestly, I'm not that big of a fan of the flea market. I think I'm just going to go home. And we can flirt with ourselves in the mirror and unlock a whim. We got this brand new keyboard. I don't know if it really fits in our apartment, but if we were to marry Joaquin, he actually might would like it. So I don't think I'm going to get rid of it. We'll just kind of put it right here for right now. What's going on right here? Something is smelling up under this rug. Hold on. Is that the little chalk outline that I covered up? I didn't know that was going to be a problem. What can I do? Attempt to repair? I didn't know this whole time the smell was coming from our apartment. Okay, I guess that's it. I guess I can put my rug back down. At least now I know that when she gets tense from the smell, it's actually something that we need to handle. I think I'm gonna put this up for right now. I don't really want it out. Let's put our lamp out instead. And this little lamp too, it's so cute. Oh, Don has texted us again. He's wanting to go out on another date, but I feel like I should say no because we've already kind of finished our relationship with Don. As sad as I am to say that, I don't feel like we can marry Don because he's an elder. I just feel like it's not going to work out for this particular Let's Play. We do need to have one more romance with someone before we get married, so we need one more good friend with romantic interest. And I have not decided yet whether I want to actually marry Joaquin or Condor. Because Condor does have a child already, but his child is a teenager. And we need to adopt a child, but I don't know how easy and quick it would be to adopt his teenager. So I'm wondering if maybe we shouldn't marry Joaquin and maybe be a little bit romantic with Condor. Maybe we should just get to know them both better. That's probably what I should do because I actually don't know either of them well enough to make that decision right now. I think I'm gonna have to let Anna go to sleep though and she needs to eat also. We're gonna get promoted in the morning though. That's nice. We're gonna be halfway through our career. We'll be at Politician 5. Is that Penny having a party again? You guys, it is. It's not even let me complain. It says I can break in or switch control to this household. No, I want to go pound on the door. I'm mad now. Okay, here she comes. At least she came out a little bit quicker this time. Let's complain angrily about the noise again. And she's good now. She says, once again, I'm sorry, you're right. Thanks for being a good neighbor. But if she's gonna do that every single night, I feel like that's annoying. I don't think Penny Pizzazz is a good neighbor, you guys. We've got a little bit of money. I think I'm gonna buy a little bit of a painting to go back here behind the bed. I think I'm gonna work on decorating the bed first and then we'll move out to the rest of the apartment. I think I'm gonna do this painting. I just really like this painting. I think I've mentioned this before in speed builds, but I just like it. So there, and we might could use some lights to go on each side of it as well. It's a little bit big for the bedroom, but I think I'm gonna go with it. She's feeling good about it. She's got a happy mood lit from a good decorated environment. Oh, the smell's back. Unsettled by odor, no, we just cleaned it. I don't wanna clean it every day. I think today we're gonna complain to the landlord about it, see if he can sort it out. No, I don't wanna protest in my own apartment. Oh, it's kind of hard to find the little spot to click on. There it was, okay, complain to landlord this time. He fixed the bug problem. Maybe he will fix this problem. 
I feel bad for complaining about Penny now because she does make a lot of noise, but to be fair to her, her apartment probably smells because of our apartment. We got our promotion. We haven't called the landlord yet, but we just got promoted and we get to select a branch for Anna to go into. So we can be a charity organizer, use your political powers for the greater good, raise money and fund a solution for the cause you support. Or we can become a politician, secure votes, give speeches and become the national leader. Better brush up on your public policy. Let's see, which one makes more money? The politician makes more money. I think that's what I'm gonna go with. Let's do it. It's Monday through Friday, it looks like. That's pretty good. And maybe we don't have to protest as much. All right, we've been promoted to a civil servant. We now make a grand total of 65 smillions per hour. We also got a bonus, a new interaction, several new interactions, like four. We can ask for a small or a large bribe. Oh, that's cool. And we can make empty promises. I love it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So are we off work today? I didn't get to choose whether I wanted to work from home or not. It says that to get promoted, we need to secure two votes. We'll go get Don's vote. Don't worry, it's good. And our landlord's gonna come over. He says he's gonna come check out the smell. Here he comes. He's just gonna clean it. He's just gonna do the same thing we did. Maybe we could get his vote. Let's chat with him when he gets done. Oh, he's leaving. Don't leave. I need you. Okay, friendly political career. We're not really great friends with him, but we can promote our policies and maybe he'll like them. I have no idea how to say his name. Howie? I'm gonna say Howie. Oh, he seemed really receptive when we promoted our policies. Political action should be easier with this sim now. I love that. We'll ask him a little bit more about himself before we just go straight for asking for his vote. I feel like that's very aggressive. Oh, she's leaving. She's going to work. No, she, I wanted to work from home. Maybe I don't have that option anymore. Okay, Howie, you can leave. No, he's going to watch TV. Anyway, to get promoted, we need to secure two votes. And then that's our daily task as well. So that's easy. That's not bad. We have four vacation days, but we might wait until we get married. And then maybe we could go take a vacation. I think that would be fun. And I think we should go to Sulani. But if you would rather see Anna go somewhere else, let me know in the comments. I think this is actually a good place to end today's episode, though. I feel like we didn't get a lot done, but we're getting there. We're making progress. Maybe in the next episode we can go on a date with Condor or Joaquin and kind of get to know them a little bit better but let me know what you guys think down below in the comments because I always love hearing from you guys thank you so much for watching today's episode I hope you all are doing really really well and I'll see you soon with another part of this series but that is all for today so bye guys